It's hard to believe, but Thanksgiving is this week. A chef from Chestnut Hill is showing Tiffany and I how to whip up some classic side dishes, but with a twist. And the best part is they're easy to make and affordable. With just 27 seats, Chef Dave's in Chestnut Hill is a cozy and intimate restaurant, but don't let the size fool you. What's cooking in the kitchen packs big, bold flavors. We are ready. Step one complete. Owner and chef Dave Welch is showing us how to really wow your family and friends this Thanksgiving. First up, French green beans with a twist. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees. We're going to roast these on high heat today. So, Tiffany, Anna, we're going to start with the both of you. A splash of olive oil, sea salt, and then the surprise, cranberries. Beautiful. All right. We're going to spread it out. See those beautiful colors? Mm -hmm. It Once looks again. perfect for Thanksgiving. Pop it in the oven for about 10 to 15 minutes, but make sure to keep an eye on them. You're looking for that nice little crispy brown on the French bean. What makes Chef Dave's restaurant unique is the menu. From burgers and pasta to ribs, the private chef turned restaurant owner drew inspiration from his clients that include musicians and even a former president. Eating is fun. My thing is with my catering business, I didn't limit myself to a menu. Look at that. A drizzle of balsamic glaze and then add a bit of crunch to the green bean mix. We're going to take these almonds. See those beautiful colors? Mm. This is very fall. Yeah. See how that comes together beautifully? Just like that. Now for the fun part, the taste test. We really couldn't wait for the forks. Mm. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it is so good. But with the almonds, the crunch, mm. the flavors, the balsamic, it's not overly done. And the cranberries, there's like a little hint of sweetness yes. to it. Yes, and imagine this with turkey or mm. steak. We've also been roasting about a dozen Yukon potatoes for this classic side dish. I love potatoes, they're my yeah. favorite food. And when you can slide a knife through them, hollow the potatoes over some warm butter and creme fraiche, but be careful. And you want to make sure you have the hot mitt on because these potatoes are piping hot. And here's an unexpected kick, horseradish. It gives it a nice little pop. Give it a good mash, sprinkle in some parsley, and add a dash of salt and pepper. This looks like heaven to me. This is like my favorite food right here. Mmm. And you wouldn't think to put sour, um, horseradish in it. These were so creamy and so Gosh. delicious. Both dishes took less than 45 minutes, and that says a lot for us. This is how you win Thanksgiving. Chef Dave says some of the best dishes are easy and affordable, and we'll be surprised if these even make it to the Thanksgiving table. It's a very simple dish to make, but it's very flavorful.